Hey guys, it's Metro, and today we're going to be doing a hike at Acres Mill. It's one of the best places to hike in Atlanta within the Chattahoochee River National Recreation Area, so let's keep moving. Okay, so we're out here at Acres Mill. This is in the Palisades area, and it leads down to the Devil's Race Course. I've passed by there a few times to see people on the right-hand side, which is adjacent to the Indian Trail Palisades. Either way, we're going to go ahead and check this out. It's a very short hike, but looking forward to it. Let's keep moving. Okay, so if you're new to this channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell as I try to release weekly videos every single Sunday on places to hike throughout Georgia and beyond. If you're new to this channel, make sure you send me a comment as I love to hear from all new viewers. That being said, let's keep moving. This is wild. I've never been here before, and I've been going to the Chattahoochee River National Recreation Area for years. And for whatever reason, I just never even heard of this place or even thought to look this up. And it's just a great, great area. I think you can see there's tons of switchbacks going downhill for the most part as soon as you get on trail. It's very cool, very relaxing, very nice. So I don't know if you can see this or not. But it's pretty much all switchbacks coming down this hill so it's gonna be nice on the way back because uh what goes down must come up right okay so it was like maybe three tenths of a mile or so across the road here i have no idea where i'm going so Hopefully this is right. I'm trying to get down to the Devil's Race Course, the Devil's Shoals. I think this is the right way. But again, thinking doesn't mean it is correct. So the trail marker here. <clears throat> Let's see here. I assume coming about right here. Let's go ahead and go to the right real quick. So we got the Devil's Race Course over to my left out here. We're just walking alongside the river. I anticipate this is the right way to go. But again, this is all new to me, so just a learning experience for both of us, I guess. Let's keep moving. Look at that, that's cool. The course in between the layers of that rock. Well, <clears throat> I'm walking through a bunch of spider webs, so obviously nobody's really been out here. Look at all these rocks. This is great. Very cool. Such a different place. As you can see, terrain is way different than it was when we first got in this area. We're gonna continue making our way. Let's see what else we can find. So graceful. Watch your stuff. I don't know, man. This is a little dramatic. Got a little cave up in there. Pretty cool. As you can see, getting down here is a little intense. 
this is not easy terrain. I'm still trying to figure out exactly where I'm at. Now this is in Atlanta, you know what I'm saying? Like this to keep in mind here. We are walking along the riverbank. Not sure how much further this trail is gonna go. This keeps going though. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that the top part is the area that connects with Pace's Mill. Not 100%. Okay, so it's Metro, we're at Acres Mill, and this is probably the most aggressive hike I've ever done on the Chattahoochee River National Recreation Area. I mean, the terrain is just crazy. There's a trail here. I don't know if it's an established trail. More like a bushwhacking. Anyway, if you're looking for a nice aggressive hike in town, Acres Mill is a nice one for you. Let's keep moving. Man, oh man. That was an aggressive, aggressive hike. Oh my gosh. Okay, so earlier we went to the right, which was grueling. Now let's go to the left. Hopefully this is a lot easier. I'm all covered in dirt. This is way easier. So as you can see, completely different terrain. He chose to take a left. I have been almost every trailhead in the Chattahoochee River National Recreation Area and I have never done any type of scrambling like that before that was intense I mean the trail keeps going up to that one rock face again and other videos I'll probably connect it put a link in the top left or right or whatever it is so you can check out that video we'll be going back there again soon Might be a little turned around here. I have never seen this spot before. Okay, now I know where we're at. Awesome. Okay. So, this is what I was talking about earlier. This is a popular hangout spot. That is the Devil's Race Course down there. Right, so that means the Palisades, or the Indian Trail Palisades, are up in this area over here. There's the jump off rock. So again, on the weekends, this place will get packed. There's tons of people here just hanging out having a good time. If you've been watching some of my videos, you'd see us come down this area right here. And it looks like that's the jump rock, jumping rock or whatever you wanna call it. Very cool, new perspective of this area. Never seen it before, this, or actually stood on this area. As a warning, <laughs> Don't die here. No, mira aquí. Don't die here. He's telling you. That's what they're referencing, that jump rock right there. People jump off and sometimes don't make it out. But such is life. All right, let's just continue on to the left and see what else we can find. So again, on the weekends, this place is full of people just hanging out by the water. All the kayakers and tubers come down. There's a devil's race course right there. They swoop around and hang out in this little area. Oh, 
I always wondered how to get down here and now I figured it out. But if you're looking for places to go within the Chattahoochee River, I'm gonna put a link up in the top right for you to check out with all of these different areas along the river. Always something new. You never know what you're gonna find. Very cool. This is just incredible to have a new perspective. Oh wow, this is just so cool. Okay, so as we start making our way over here, there is the Indian Trail East Palisades over across the way here. And as you can see where those people are, that's where the ruins are. And you see a little bit of rapids here, it's fun. You shoot through here. And then down there is where the Magical Bamboo Forest is. So this is one of my favorite stretches on the Chattahoochee River National Recreation Area. So cool, very awesome to see this. So over here you got a nice little sandy beach right by the shoals. Hang up a hammock right here would be really nice. I was planning on eating lunch down here, hang up the hammock myself, but I'm a little beat from that scrambling going the opposite way. By the way, I do not recommend going to the right. It is cool to see it once or whatnot, but definitely don't want to go to the right. You want to stay to the left. A lot more uh, casual stroll per se than the scramble. Okay, so if you look down there on that corner, that's where the bamboo forest is. And there's a trail that goes all the way along this side here. As you can see, some of these little hikers out here making their way down to the bamboo forest. But again, it goes up and there's the overlook that continues down to Whitewater Creek. So around the bend is the jump rock, jumping rock or whatnot, and it carries on down to Pace's Mill. Awesome day. It's awesome when you can see how all this connects. Let's keep moving. There's a great blue heron right there. I think we pretty much hit the end of the road here. I don't see I'm gonna get out there any further. But anyway, it's a great day hike here. Awesome. So earlier, when we came down this trail, and we went over there, and then went over to the right, and then circled back and went to the left. If you wanted to bypass all of this, just go to the left, and that'll take you down to that area where you can see the jumping rock, and the rapids, and so forth. That other way was, whew, that was intense. Anyway, making our way back up the hill as we went down to get to this point. It'll be nice going back up the hill. All right, so that's that. We just did an aggressive hike down to the Chattahoochee River and back. So if you found any value in this video, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and send me your comments as I do respond. As always, thanks for watching, but until next time, let's keep moving.